Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Theoni with Thrifty Divas. Thank you for stopping by. We are here for another Dollar Tree haul today. Two days, three Dollar Trees. One was really good, the other were like meh, but I still managed to find good things at each and every one. So before we begin, I just want to remind you that the 100 subscriber, subscriber appreciation giveaway is now open. Um, the title of that video does say it's open, so um, if you are a subscriber or you please would like to subscribe, I really would love to have you hit that subscribe button, head over to that entry um, if you are a U.S. resident, and um, check out the video. There's another video for contents um, of the giveaway, and yeah, so and all you have to do is just be a subscriber, be in the U.S., and type on the entry video, enter me, and you're in. Okay, and that'll remain open until Saturday, uh, yeah, Saturday, May 18th, okay? So, just wanted to tell you that before we begin. All right, so, Dollar Tree haul time. Okay. Again, grab and, grab and pull, all right? So, I've hauled this brand before, um, actually in my bacon cotton candy test test taste test video, pardon me, um, but now I found these cocoa biscuits. So these look good. They also had one this shape and it was ginger cinnamon. That also looked good too, but I'm like, what am I gonna do with all these cookies? I just really like it. I do have an espresso machine um, that can also make cappuccino. I would love to just like, whatever, have my parents over for cappuccino and be like, hey, you guys want some Italian cookies? But again, I have a lot of like images in my head. So anyway, but those look delicious. And then I got a three ounce bag of wasabi peas. The brand is uh, Munch Right by Green Acres. Yeah, so that is that. Product of China, um, in case I want something spicy. And same brand, Munch Right by Green Acres. I got two three ounce bags of the dry roasted edamame. Good soy protein there. Uh, 14 grams of protein uh, for a quarter of a cup. There's three and a half servings in this bag. Should you happen to eat the whole bag? Who am I to judge? Um, Cause you know I'll probably do it. That would be 14 times three and a half. I got nothing. I am cracking up ish at my mask. 72 right now. And another 7 79? About how Did wrong I just do that? that math I is. <laughs> I think I could be way up, but I, 79 grams of protein. Should you eat the whole So bag? wrong. So so wrong. That's I apologize. Craziness. Okay. And then Munch writes this 3 ounce bag of apple cinnamon baked puffs so they're like apple cinnamon cheese doodles i thought that looked really good uh, either for myself or my son gluten free nut free kosher vegan no msg so that's those i did pick up two bags of those and same brand munch right i got the baked veggie puffs and this is actually cheddar and sour cream. So that sounded really good too. Three ounce bag. And I picked up another box of these. I did buy like five or my, my husband bought five, but he's been grabbing like two packs when he goes to work and stuff. So they're like dwindling down super quickly. Um, and I did pick up two, but one got to the register. I had my son with me. I told you that happens. I think he got mad at me at one point and threw a box out of the cart. Yeah, well, they don't call it terrible twos for nothing. So I picked up another of the peanut butter sandwich breakfast biscuit cookies. I picked up a bottle of Kraft Hickory Smoke Barbecue Sauce. Uh, this is a 17.5 ounce bottle. I used three quarters of my last bottle when I made my husband his ribs for his dinner, uh, birthday dinner. So I needed another one. I got 
two jars of the stuffed olives with pimentos. Uh, I should not be eating these because I have high blood pressure. <sighs> but I love olives. I can't help it. So, anyway. And then, I haven't seen these ones. This is Bold and Spicy Vlasic Salsa Blend. And it is in the medium. Um, and these are the stackers. So they're the slices, the long slices, if you can see that. Um, and this is a pound, 16 fluid ounces. Um, I just thought that was interesting. Hope they're not too, too hot. But it just, they just looked good for the summer. And they have all this stuff floating around in there. See it? Looks good to me. As long, like I said, as long as they're not too spicy. Then I picked up two more things of nautical rope. I do not need them currently, but do you know why I did? Because this is me in a nutshell. Because when I purchased them, as well as many of you and many others, because when they came out, they were nine feet. Okay? Now they're 13, and I'm mad. So I just got two more to make myself feel better at the 13. It's almost like you, you almost get one free for the nine foot ones. I'm mad. Anyway, so yeah. Then they had just one random one and it's been ripped and taped and the tape is no longer sticking. It says three or more players, ages 10 and up. This is Family, Ru Family Feud Strike Out card game. And it's got Steve Harvey on the box. So it says it has 47 survey cards, three red strike cards, three blue strike cards, and instructions. I hope the instructions are in there. Uh, I hope there's an instruction card in there. If not, I'll have to Google it. But the only reason I still got it with the rip box is because it's sealed. The cards are sealed. So I just hope there's uh, an instruction card in there. Other than that, but it looks cool to me. I love games don't play enough of them but I love games then I picked up one of these in hot pink uh, a cuticle trimmer I'm hoping it works well I was trying to look at the contact in the store some of them were worse than others so if you pick these up try to make sure you get one that's nice and straight and has contact your best bet I don't know how good they are but we will find out and they had them in green and blue or something I don't know definitely green though but I found the hot pink so I was happy about that that's what I wanted and that is by sassy and chic then I found this which I've never seen before so I picked up three of these this is um, by pine glow which was weird but it's septics so it's a monthly down the toilet septic tank you know like rid X right or something like that it's called so I figured I'll give that a try. Um, and again, it's a monthly one, so I got three of them. Why not? Never saw that there before. I did pick up another one of these padded envelopes because my aunt's birthday is coming up soon, and I'm just going to mail her a little something. Hi, if you're watching. I got a third one. I got a third one for myself now. Forget it. I don't have to stress myself out about should I read something that I'm going to give as a gift? No. I will sit down whenever I have time, which is never, and I will read this, and I'm so excited. So, waiter rant. If you haven't seen it, it was in my last haul video. I picked up two of those for gifts. Then, this is the juice I usually get my son, um, the Healthy Balance Old Orchard, because it only has like one gram of sugar uh, and like, like almost like no calories, six calories, 20 calories, something of that, but one gram of sugar. Some of them have four grams of sugar, but that's about as high as you'll get it. This way I don't have to water it down, but they have two new flavors that I haven't seen before. I did get them both. This is one of them. This is the mango tangerine. So I think he'll like that just for fun. It's a new flavor. Then I don't particularly need band-aids, but I found these curate camp camo. And they are fabric. They're flex fabric bandages, but they are in the camouflage, and you do get 25. So I was super excited about that. Then I got two bars of this German's Baker's Chocolate in the um, 
it's sweet, 48% cacao. Um, a dollar is a great price. It's an amazing price. And it doesn't expire until July 2020. So I like to chop that up, put it in banana bread. You can even make, you know, chocolate chunk cookies with this. It's great. Honestly, for a buck, you can't beat it. Then I found these eight ounce bags of the Oreo minis snack sacks resealable these are two dollars at walmart and slightly higher than two at target so again for a dollar why not um and i did get three of them the ones that dollar tree usually sells for a dollar are three ounces these are eight okay moving on moving on this is heavy this is heavy because let me just get it out of here the other flavor of the Old Orchard that I found, um, again, one gram of sugar, six calories. This is the strawberry watermelon. So I've never seen this one before either. So I got two of those, which is why my bag is so heavy. Mm, so I got those out. Then I found this, never saw it before either. So this is the perfect size for one, Duncan Hines, but this is mocha cake mix. I'm so excited. Mocha is like my favorite flavor on earth. So I'm super excited to try that. Okay, then shockingly enough, I found this big 52.91 ounces of this Palmy. 100% from fresh Italian tomatoes, strained tomatoes product of Italy. 52.91 ounces, okay? I did get four. I got two for myself and two for my mother. That's also making my bag heavy. But since they're so huge, I also looked for these and I had to find them at the second store. I looked for these Sure Fresh containers. Um, this is 34 fluid ounces, and these are the ones with the screw tap. So that's good for, you know, once I open this and use it, fill up one of these with whatever's left. So I got that for the tomatoes. Okay. Then I picked up a pack of these Mickey and the Roadster Racers little bathroom cups. You get 36 of them. And they have Donald, Pluto, and Mickey on them. Oh, here they are, bigger. Duh. So that's for my son when he brushes his teeth. Ugh, take this other one out of there. Uh, I got one more thing for my 200 subscriber giveaway. <laughs> I'm nuts. I will not show it to you, though. I will not. Let's get through this one first. And there's not a lot of entries, y'all. So I'm just saying, you got a really good chance of winning right now. Okay. A couple more things, and then I will get to my three wish list items. So I this is the only store I've ever seen this at. This is for... Memorial Day, 4th of July, Labor Day, whatever. This is bunting. It is polyester bunting in the patriotic pattern. It has three grommets, three metal grommets. Uh, it is 24 inches long and 12 inches high at the you know widest part right here. So it is 100% polyester. So this is fabric. So I got three of these. One, two, three. And I am going to attach them onto some rope or something like that and I'm going to make them longer you know and space them out to put it on my huge deck back here uh that faces you know everything so I'll just put it on the side of my deck to decorate I thought th that was amazing amazing for a dollar so I was really happy with those all right now let's get into some wish list items so they have these desk signs these metal tin whatever it is a green briar product these desk signs this is just a thin piece of cardboard in here 
Um, and this one is attached, which is, oh, it's not, I lied. I was gonna say, what? Um, so it slides right out. You can put anything you want in here if you don't like this. Uh, you can actually do a nameplate for your desk if you wanted to, or have it say anything you wanted. But for now, I like this. I will attach it with double-sided tape or something on the back just so they don't slip out like that. But this one says, let me take the plastic off so you can see better. Pink with black letters does not play well with others. And then it's got the stand on the back just like that. They did have a girl boss one. Uh, and then they had, I'm kind of, uh, did I get that one? They had, I'm kind of a big deal. And then they had, I'm not bossy, I am the boss. And those are the other ones that I did not get. I got this one that says, I literally can't today. And this one's actually in a gold color. The other one was in a silver color. But I love it. Love it. And again, that cardboard just slides right out. Which could be good or bad, right? Depending on what you want to do with it. And my last one of those, <laughs> out of answers. <laughs> I love it. Oh, man. I told you, I teach, man. <laughs> I teach. I, I love it. I just love it. Out of answers. So cute. And then I told you the other ones they had. All right. Now, Pretty and Flawed showed these two last items in a walkthrough and they went on my wish list from her so please go check out pretty and flawed i will mention her in the description box please uh check her out and tell her that i sent you and maybe she'll come and uh check me out and spread some love so i got two of each one for me one for my mom as a gift for christmas probably or her birthday so these are these two like dog themed ones. This one says a home, uh, I'm sorry, a house is not a home without paw prints. Love it. And it's white and gray with the gray detail. And the other one in the set, when I needed a hand, you gave me your paw. Love it. So. Like I said, two of each, me and my mama. And my last two items, guys. Again, Pretty and Flawed showed it to me. I showed these in my walkthrough and I said there's two more but I'm not showing them to you because I got them. <laughs> this is one. Love it with the hanger, laundry, wash and fold service, premium 24 seven. And the side looks like that. Okay, and it's just hollow. You hang it there, or this will just stand by itself. But I am going to put this in my laundry room. And my last item, with the clothespins, wash, open 24 hours, laundry. And the side of this is super cute. See those clothespins? I love that detail. Same thing in the back, you could hang it, or it would just stand up by itself if you wanted. Um, so let me just tell you, and those are for my laundry room. I got those because way back, I, I and I've mentioned this in a video um, that I really want them and I still want them. I saw like one person, maybe two, but I really think it was just one, show either in a hall or in a walkthrough, I don't remember, they showed a board with the clips and it was like lost socks and then it was like laundry room they had two of them and it had the clips at the bottom kind of like all those picture frames do right now but it had the clips at the bottom oh my god yeah i never saw those anywhere maybe they'll still come but whatever i love these cute um and like i said didn't stop me from getting the other ones if they come and just like I wanted the Life is Better with Sprinkles notebook. I never found that one that I wanted, but I got another one with the same saying. I feel like there's like a pattern in Dollar Tree. You see what I'm saying? I feel like they'll put out a wave and then like you don't get it or it's like sparse and then they'll put out like a 
kind of the same item but different and then like the nautical rope like oh nautical rope yay nine feet but then like a month later you're like 13 and I feel like that's just their like thing I might be reading too much into it but I feel like I feel like I'm on to something here <laughs> all right guys so that is my haul um, I hope you enjoyed and please sorry for bending and please um, if you have not already please subscribe and then if you're in the US go check out that subscriber giveaway you just type enter me and you'll be entered and you could win my magical giveaway so I'm gonna add just a couple like literally a minute and a half if that of just a few things that I saw at the end of this but that is all okay so until we meet again stay blessed my friends and I love you all thank you for viewing and thank you be for being loyal subscribers if you are all right bye bye see you soon guys I showed you this Kiko man wasabi sauce in a walkthrough the other day and today they had the Kiko man sriracha hot chili sauce as well and they also had the Heinz hot and spicy tomato ketchup i i've gotten the cars i showed you the glow cars and the glow airplanes but today i saw they had glow flutes and glow spinning tops as well so that's all hope you enjoyed thanks for watching